Hello, everybody. Uh, welcome to episode two of James Reviews Trailers. We got a we got a pretty good one. We got the the m most popular uh, grossed film of the '90s. She's all that, featuring a Freddie Prince Jr. and a woman. It's a teen romance comedy. My three three things I know a whole lot about. Uh, I don't know much about it. I didn't research it. Uh, I'm pretty bad at everything. But we're gonna take a look and I'm gonna review it and here we go. Zack Seiler had it all. How's it going, man? President of his class, captain of the team, and dating the most popular girl in school. He's so cool. Holy shit, I wanna be just like him. Until she went on spring break. So I've been dancing for maybe five minutes, right? And that's when it happened. I'm back on team! Brock is from the real world, like the TV show. That show sucked. Oh, okay. But they kicked him out of the house. My condolences go out to Zach. Is that Usher? Jesus Christ. Usher? Who got dissed and dismissed by his magically delicious girlfriend. In order to save his reputation, he's taken on an impossible bet. I'll pick the girl. Paul Walker and Usher in the same movie? What? Rest in peace, I had to say it. And you got six weeks to turn her into the prom queen. She kinda looks like me, like the trans version of me, right? No? Okay. Gentlemen, we have a winner! Hey! You call off the bet, you lose. I don't lose. So, Lanny, listen. I was wondering if maybe you'd want to embarrass me horribly in front of all these people. I think that she's already hot. I think she's hot enough as Alta. I would take her like this. <laughs> so, who's the lucky rebound girl? She kind of blew me off. I like her already. Was this some kind of new dork outreach program? There's a little taco on her head. That's hysterical. That's a little fabric taco. And I'm not gonna ignore it. I'm not gonna not say nothing when she has a little fabric taco on her head. Find out where she hangs out. What she does for fun. <laughs> Oh, she's weird. Don't tell me you guys are on a date. No, we're just friends. I feel just like Julia Roberts in Pretty Woman, you know, except for the whole hooker thing. I just realized Freddie Prince Jr. is in Scooby-Doo. I think he plays uh, Fred. To everyone here who matters, you're vapor. I forgot why I avoided places like this and people like you. <laughs> Am I a bet? Am I a stupid bet? This is one contest you're gonna lose. It's going down, man. Are you kidding me with this dance right now? Jesse, am I kissable? But now, he's about to realize that she's a whole lot more than he bargained for. She doesn't like her million dollar makeover or her overnight popularity? What is it? Hey, man, she's not a stupid bet. That's not, that's not the point, man. I cared about her. So kiss me. Why'd you really come here, Zach? I forget. So kiss me. She's all that. Um, okay, I'm not gonna lie. That made me a little emotional. That was really, really good. Uh, really well done. Uh, the ending made me almost cry a little bit, but I'm not a little bitch. But that was fantastic. I mean, they didn't give away too much. They gave away just enough. They leave you really wondering what's going to happen. I mean, Freddie Prince Jr. did amazing. And the girl, that actress, I don't know her name. I'm not going to look it up. But fantastic. They got Paul Walker and Usher in the same movie. What other film are Paul Walker and Usher both in? I'll tell you which one. Not anyone. Uh, it was really good. They didn't They didn't step on their e each other. I don't know. They didn't step on anything. It was it was great. 